Good afternoon, everyone. Hail blanket southern Saudi Arabia and the Al Baha region. This is right next to the Yemen border. Hail dropping in New South Wales. Look at the size of these hailstones. The price of ground beef hitting an all time record high in February. And part of this series covers agricultural losses due to cold weather anomalies in the new solar minimum that's already begun. And a thousand references to global cooling for those who want to dig deeper into news events around the world since 2004. Severe hailstorms ravaging cotton crops, not such a news story on its own in New South Wales, but check out the size of these hailstones. And in the same days in Queensland, Look at the size of these pieces of ice falling out of the sky. Yes, those are inch markers on the ruler there. And as agricultural losses go, you might ask yourself, why is the price of ground beef so high now? The cattle herds are the smallest they've been since 1951. Draw your own conclusion. Why are the herds so small? Lack of water, drought, feed prices are too high, so it's not economical to, to feed the cattle. There's just a lot of variables inside there. Consumer price index rising, rising, rising into infinity. And as we get into the new global cooling pattern in this solar minimum, those prices are going to increase exponentially from probably 2017 forward. But it should increase continually until that point. And then it's going to hit the rocket fuel stage and go straight up. When food prices rise that quickly, people are going to be angry. Jumping into Saudi Arabia, very close to the Yemen border. This is in southern Saudi Arabia on the Red Sea. Inches and inches of hail coming down. Saudi Arabia had snow in the north. UAE had a massive hailstorm last month. And it just makes you wonder what's going on with atmospheric compression. Look at the depth of some of these areas. Remember, this is... Far south in Saudi Arabia in the desert area. Sure, it's at a couple thousand feet in elevation. It doesn't explain how can there be so much hail inside an area that is usually 40 degrees Celsius. Taking a look back a couple weeks, check out the dust storm in Oman. The winds had to be incredibly heavy to be pushing this much ditterous and debris into the air. Nice satellite view, though. And for those of you wanting to do more reference research on the new solar minimum, different news events that haven't been covered in the mainstream media about global cooling. I'm leaving you with a reference, a link to a thousand different news articles about cold weather events on the planet since 2004. Again, I'll leave you with a temperature reconstruction map of the little ice age. Notice where the cooling pattern happened in the past and where do you see that things are actually starting to repeat patterns. Thanks for watching. Hope you got something out of the video.